Let's continue our lesson of the nation's history. A nightmare befell the land. And soon afterward, the Aesir and the Vanir began a war over the Cauldron. The Aesir were exhausted from the war with our nation, and the Vanir defeated them. The Aesir withdrew, but after finding the Ring of Tichrel that the fairies used to control the Cauldron, both countries began a long war to control this area. Hmm? What's wrong? <laughs> a great storm has raged against our land ever since the disaster. It seems that there's a tremendous amount of magical energy around the Cauldron. It's probably because the Cauldron's still active. A great storm has raged against our land ever since the disaster. It seems that there's a tremendous amount of magical energy around the cauldron. It's probably because the cauldron's still active. I wonder if our country will ever be like it was before. Hello, Princess. Business is going very well. I've come back to stock up. With this war going on, it seems that the Fairy Kingdom's a tad unstable. A great storm has raged again. A great... A great... She went to the netherworld with that sorcerer? This is so dangerous. Oh, I'm so nervous. Ah, he may still be nearby. She's been looking gloomy ever since she returned. If I may ask, why are you so frightened? My grandfather. King Valentine has escaped the netherworld. The deceased king? But how? My grandfather was interested in the cauldron. If that is true, it must surely refer to the great cauldron that appears in the prophecies. Is this the beginning of the end of the world? I do not know. It is impossible to speculate the motives of a king who has escaped the netherworld. You have such great wisdom. Do you know of any way to prevent this destruction, Father? Hmm. A single ring controls the cauldron. The ring? That my grandfather was wearing? Indeed, the ring of Titrell. If that ring is used to stop the cauldron, no one can restart it, not even a king. Where is this ring now? It's in the Fairy Kingdom, where the cauldron has been taken. I shall sneak in and recover the ring. What are you saying? Velvet! I would rather fight against death than wait for my cursed destiny to take me. I know a man who can magically send himself there. If I asked him... If you are discovered, all Puka will be labeled as criminals. Please, do not tell anyone of this. I don't want anyone else involved. Moving in the shadows will not hide you from the fairies for long. That is when this change shall protect me.
intrude in the palace while my mother is away in battle. Oh no! Princess Mercedes! What? You... Grandfather, did something happen? A thief defeated the knights and snuck into the palace. This woman is that thief. I can see that. You have something of ours. Return my mother's ring immediately. What was that? Is that the ring to Trell? This ring is at the center of this debacle. It belongs to Valentine. This abominable treasure has no place with fairies. It seems there's more to this story. But you are mistaken. The rightful owner of that ring surrendered it to us. It is ours. King Valentine passed away during the disaster. Your lies are transparent. I tell no lie. The ring was given to our queen. By the surviving Prince of Valentine. <gasps> prince? It can't be... Ingwe. Even if that's the case, I cannot return the ring. You are not going anywhere! Guards! Guards! ourselves be seen. Hurry, we have to hide. So this is the ring that can stop the cauldron. This whole area is a war zone right now. No one will be able to come search for it. Father, is the king really trying to create another disaster? I know not the king's mind. But if the king wishes to use the cauldron for atrocity once again, 
The only one able to stop him is the one who knew him in life. It will be up to Princess Velvet. But I cannot bear to see the princess in such danger. I cannot believe what I'm hearing. I did not give you that chain so you could act like a thief. Ingwei. Have you any idea how dangerous that ring is? Let me hold on to it, Velvet. Give me the ring. How do you know about this? We are twins. There is nothing you can hide from me. You said that Scaldi has friends in the Fairy Kingdom, did you not? If that chain makes you act so irrationally, shall I take it away? Don't glare at me like that. I'm just worried about you. I'm sorry if I've upset you. Please, just leave me alone. I will eventually get that ring. But first, how can I stop the prattling of those old men who talk of nothing but Titrell? 